and welcome to AD4 TV Radio News Extract, coming to you from Abuja, Nigeria's capital city. I am Jessica Bachai. A guidance expert has again restated the importance of nurturing and mentoring individuals to achieve growth potentials. Fatima Atiku of the Shewu Musa Yaradua Foundation, in an interview with AD4 TV Radio, advocated that mentorship should be an industry-wide practice. I am what who I am or what I am is also a product of mentorship I was able to understand certain things because there were other people to show me the way it's like having it's like the concept of discipleship you know having people to disciple to bring them up in the way they are supposed to go in the political the economic I don't think there is any notable person in this world that has achieved something that would say that they have done so without somebody else showing them the way if you now suddenly break down that value chain, you know, having someone there that shows the other young people the ropes, either politically, business-wise, or economically, in whatever sphere, you are leaving a generation that absolutely are leaving a generation with no roadmap, no guide. You know, we make mistakes so that the other people can learn and see, oh, this is the mistakes this person has made, so I can be able to, that's why technology exists. You know, people are able to do things a lot easier because someone has, you know, already put the roadmap of how certain things should be done at this particular point in time. So if it, mentorship is something that should be industry-wide, nationwide, however you want to put it. And that's why you have some companies like, let's say, uh, McKinsey, Goldman Sachs, they bring in interns straight from university right into the system. And then they somehow pair them with people in the company that can ensure that their progress is monitored. And then they eventually hire these people back in. They are, they are doing that intentionally. That in itself is a sense of mentorship. That is how they get talents. That's how they get people to stay on their workforce and create a sense of productivity. Remember, coronavirus is real. Ensure you wash your hands regularly. Use alcohol-based hand sanitizers. Wear your masks besides maintaining social distancing. That's it on 84 TV Radio News Extract. You can join the conversation on our website at www.84tvradio.com. Please follow us on our social media platforms at 84 TV Radio on Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn, and Instagram. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel at 84 TV Radio as well. Many thanks for watching. I am Jessica Ochai.